What the fuck hit me? No, you're out. No, you are. My game is freaking out. Mate, my game is really badly freaking out. I think it's like, I don't know what to do because it's trying to summon shit in. Ah, I just got hit by the fucking. Ah, nothing even popped in. <laughs> Mate, the game is freaking out. There's nothing. Like, there's so much noise and shit happening. Yet there's nothing really happening, you know what I mean? Yeah, and it, it counts for anything. I randomly just got hit by clay out of nowhere. And the clay that is behind me, I get ahead of it, and then suddenly it's right behind my ass. Yeah, um, oh, there it is again! Not touched by anything yet, here it is, ready to catch me. Yeah, but you're a host, so that's maybe better, I guess, I don't know. I don't know, the thing's just really fast all of a sudden. Yeah, I'm driving a bit of Me, I'm getting hit by it, just constant goo from nothing. Nothing's even touched me, it's just it's coming past me. You've done it, Lewis! Oh, thank fuck! Are you far ahead, is that thing? Not that far ahead, but the amount of shit I... The moment you got past me, right, I got hit my clay out of nowhere. I didn't even, there wasn't any in front of me or anything, I just got the clay on my screen. Like, uh, and then next yeah, that's you know, what was happening the entire time for me as well. Are you kidding me, it's heat? Ice was a mistake. I shouldn't have gone by the Arkham rules. He's solid, he can't stretch. So you can still throw shit at him. True, but he's got limits. See? The shit! Ow, ow, ow. Thank you. Wait to turn these furnaces up a little higher, get them to fucking dry up. No, that really just keep shit in the I can't! I equipped ice, remember? I, I have been using my moves on here. It's just they're not that effective because it's ice.
push that shun. I don't know what you're going to say. No, he's not dumb. Finally done in. <laughs> so you get arrested and they just have them one PC? No, no, I think they've put them into separate tubes. Yeah, they have. Looks like you had some fun. Now for the real fun part. Clean up and paperwork. Just another day at the office. Stopping a clay monster from drowning the city isn't the weirdest thing I've ever done. Gotham's gotta keep you guessing. And busy. The commissioner wants me to bag and tag each piece of clay individually. Thank okay. you for that. Oh, I'll still have the trouble making friends. That's the understatement of the year. I swear, if you spandex people weren't so useful, I... He's gonna lose it. Why do I even bother? Twenty-four. I'm level twenty-four. Clay burner pistols, three hundred and twenty damage. Hmm. Uh, 
I need to wear one more again. No, let me, I'll just get this up. Good. Mm -hmm. Sean, what's awkward about this now is the fact that we've done all the side shit, so now all it is is literally just... The main shit? Turning up to people and getting rewards for doing stuff. Mm. Doing the time trials, doing the pre meditated stuff and then doing the main shit. Mm. But there's more pages for us to collect. Again, and there's an hour time trial and there's a bunch of people that want to talk to us to get rewards. What we could do, Sean, is see while you're doing the crimes in the bottom city. Mm -hmm. I could fast travel to the do top city, talk to the girl from the watch, do the heroic travel time trial, mm -hmm. do the page thing from the Court of Elves, then go into the middle city and get her rewards from Jada Tompkins and Lucius Fox. Mm -hmm. Do the prisoner transport attack and then do the Montoya and the time trial uh, down there as well. Mm -hmm. And by that time you should have done the organ trafficking. The criminal deal, the illegal hack, the crime scene investigation, and the criminal deal. Right. And then once we've done all of that stuff, all we have to do is meet up outside the Belfry and then go talk to Italia. <laughs> But first, the last me eighties, I'm going to smoke a fucking filthy cigarette. And I'm going to let my dogs out for we in the, what sounds like hot, uh, rather cold rain. Mm. Of course, I will be there with them. Yeah. Sounds like an absolute nightmare of a doozy. You just keep your headset on, see if it reaches. No. Uh, if it's raining. I mean, I ain't getting my fucking thing wet. <laughs> Fuck yeah, it's a current suit. What? Uh, I said, Fuck yeah, to the current suit. It's beautiful. God, I won that move. something in the water here what do you mean you know there's yet another evil group of rich people in masks who want to run this city <laughs> just to be safe I'm going to see what I can find in the city records I was kidding about the water it's just an expression you put the idea in my head now I have to be certain Goddamn ninjas. Goddamn talents. They all just make me wanna... To do what? <sighs> A proper investigation. Followed by reasonable arrests and handing the perps over to the authorities.
Good job on those recording masks, Tim. We might actually have a shot at taking these guys down. Thanks, Babs. You did a great job at reconstructing the data. Nerds to the rescue, as usual. Authorities have finally brought the criminal known as Mr. Freeze in from the cold. Freeze escaped Blackgate Penitentiary with the help of a powerful new suit that reportedly resembled a spider. He was taken down by authorities in a daring battle said to involve at least one vigilante. Despite numerous reports to the contrary, GCN has confirmed the vigilante presence did not include Batman, whose absence persists despite a noticeable uptick in major crimes. Freeze is now being held in an upgraded, specialized prison cell at Blackgate, where he awaits trial for numerous federal and state crimes. I'm Noor Rashid, and this is GCN. You know, Freeze was the first villain I ever faced as Robin. He still had a glimmer of humanity then. Gotham has a way of making monsters. Proof of that's everywhere lately. We haven't seen a breakout of this scale in a while. The last person that attacked the prison was Black Mask, I think. That's right. He wanted to kill one of his rivals before he could go into witness protection. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Good times. They managed to make Freeze's weather machine portable. We have to give it to the regulators. Their tech was impressive. Its potential for destruction was immeasurable. Good thing we stopped Freeze before he caused any more damage. Indeed. Hello. Hello. I've returned. Nice. <coughs> Victor Freeze is back in his cell, along with extra security. I don't think he'll try something else anytime soon. Sometime in this universe. Never seems so mm -hmm. defeated. His first ever Without his wife and hope for a cure. What? He must not have much else to live for. Hmm. We thought. <coughs> hmm. 
Yeah. And then um, Jason was talking about the first major, or the last ever major breakout of um, Blackgate. Mm -hmm. With Black Max, um, that was breaking into the prison to kill one of the drivers. He was like, that's good to. <laughs> yeah, just, just like, really? He was like, what? <laughs> Uh, Victor is a brilliant scientist. Jason was I can't help but wonder if Batman yeah, yeah. had been able to help him, if he was safe with him. No. How can you be so sure? Freeze's condition didn't change. It revealed him. He didn't have to become a man. There's no cure for who Freeze really is. No, I mean, funny. yes and no to that. Yeah. Because <laughs> in this universe, we don't actually know what made him snap, because he's yeah. never spoke about having a wife or anything like that. No, he's not said anything of fucking Nora. Mm -hmm. Which is what made me think maybe she did die and like, he's just given up, but at the same time, it turns out he's, he's done a good few awful things before he was... Like, yeah, things. No, but the, no, but the thing is, is... Tim went, oh, Mr. Freeze was my first ever villain um, with Batman at the time. Mm. And then Alfred so went, but that was when machine. Mr. Freeze, Freeze still had a and sitting in the And that's when Barbara said he never had a, like, the moment he became Mr. Such Freeze. Outstanding so security. It just showed what he truly was, as opposed to... Which I say is hypocritical, considering she literally defended Kane's daughter being the commissioner. Earlier by sitting there saying not all cops are corrupt in a sense, but like we all know she's not doing anything to clean up the cop system, so it's very likely she's a suspect. So why Barbara said is like we sh we should give her a chance and everything. It's like you can't have that same attitude and then sit there and say Mr. Freeze. It just made him who he really was. Yeah. Rather hypocritical of you, Barbara. Well, Blackgate is going to hold Freeze this time. The scene, we'll keep an eye on it. It is Harley's haven, after all. She's the one who told him about Bruce. You know that. Well, right? yeah. You think so? Because he went messed No doubt. Like, we'll need to keep an eye like, on both of them. Oh, I've known for a while. He didn't say anything about knowing race or anything like that. Well, at the same time, I think you could guess that, though, considering Bruce adopted Dick, then Jason. Then Tim, I think Jacob uh, might have found it very easy to be able to sit and put two and two together. I really know Barbara Gordon. Well, Did that we out is one I will say is different. Jailbreak. But at the same time, cold, but I'm it's very looking. possible that he was able to track her First down off, through Gordon nice and one. everything. Second, you're already on this? I'm obviously mm. five steps ahead of you at all times. Yeah, you know what? Right. Yeah, you I'm, ready to I'm exit the belfry? Did you find anything weird in Freeze's tech? It's strange. Some of it is based on his own work, but other parts of it were from a source I can't trace yet. That's probably not good. Uh, at least we know he can't remake it easily. You know, we were right, though, Sean. I just thought of something. Mm hmm. See, if you let yourself calm down of the whole situation of Matthew Big speaking, you're aware when Matthew disagrees with what happened with you that night. I don't know. I can only try not to. I just mean your friends, you know what I mean? You're better off. True. We 
caught Freeze. Even if we had to do it twice. Yeah, even with his giant spider robot, he couldn't stop us. You're thinking of building one, aren't you? Just for research purposes. We're doing this. Do you want to see your sleeping pattern from us being there? Harley Quinn, mm -hmm. criminal mastermind Is that the same as your normal sleeping pattern? Dr. Q has been taken into police what, in the sense of going to bed? Uh, usually, yeah. If I go to bed late, I need to get off late. If I go to bed early, that's will be held at Blackhaven mm. Prison, where she faces a litany of charges. Provided they manage to keep her in custody long enough to stand trial. This is Noor Rashid with GCN. I guarantee, man. Carlo, now better known as Clayface, has been apprehended by Gotham's You don't start work again to Thursday, Anna. Catherine Kane gave a statement yeah. assuring the public that Carlo's arrest was, quote, cut and dry, and that the situation had been tomorrow, contained. Uh, the refused to confirm reports that Vigilante oh, no, might do some drawing. Carlo's arrest. This Finish that summary poem, finally. Rashid, Gotham's trusted voice for what matters to you. Mm. With Clayface in pieces again, I wonder how the GCPD will safely, uh, store him. Plastic containers in the fridge? He'll stay fresher that way. in thought, Master Richard. I kind of feel bad for Clayface. He just wanted to be understood, and we punished him for it. Making others suffer to ease his own pain was dangerous and wrong. I know he didn't give us a choice, mm -hmm. but I still I wish we could have helped him somehow. You have a big yeah, that's fine. Don't ever lose that. Please don't forget to boil water for the next few days, Master Jason. I know. We wouldn't want you to have another... incident. 
I'm never gonna live that one down, am I? Knowing Master Richard, probably not. John, you know what I think is funny? <clears throat> mm -hmm. Seen the original comics of Batman? Yeah. Dick Grayson, like his full name was Dick Grayson, like it wasn't Richard. Because mm -hmm. at the time, in the 40s, Dick was a normal name. Yep. But as it became more of an insult, they changed it to Richard, but it was short. Did you hear about Dick. Clayface's last yep. premiere? Do you mean Dick was short for Richard? It was yeah. a smashing success. Yeah. But originally, he was just actually called Dick, like it wasn't supposed to be Richard, and it was short. Oh, I know. And then you had, um, some Nightwing writers who hated him being called Dick and all the Dick jokes, so they had it made be called Richard. And then they did it where the writer of Nightwing, who was sick of everyone making Dick jokes, um, he, we got Rick when Nightwing was an amnesiac. The mess that came after, fuck. I have to say, like, people are saying, we'll like, oh, DC's doing again? great, they're doing what Marvel doesn't, Not allowing the characters to grow and everything. Like, look, yeah. Batman's yeah. like a dad, yeah. Superman's a dad, yeah. like, yeah. Superman's yeah. married, yeah. Batman nearly got Either married. Really. Spider-Man, he can't be married to have kids. Like, I completely agree on that, yeah, but at the same time, you're not saying much, because Batman has the same treatment as Spider-Man when it comes to romance. Yeah. Oh. He's... Oh. I'm back in a break. Okay, but no, um... A typical thing between Batman and Spider-Man is they both don't get anything in the sense for the long run. Batman was engaged to Catwoman, and they were going to get married and everything be together. Next thing you why know, was, why is there extra room at the end here? Like when he was I think that will be from the actual main campaign. Dry? Like a sauna? The, um, is that a smell? Like Court of Owls mask? Mask. Then the Very possible. Do I want to know what you're looking into? 